Hello, and welcome to this brief overview on archives in Morpheus. Archives provide a way to store your files and make them available for download by your scripts and users. Archives are organized by buckets and can be tied to any existing bucket or file share that may be currently integrated. For more information on integrating new storage targets, visit our documentation linked below. Storage buckets in public clouds, on networked storage, or even in the appliance itself may be used to host files. To view or create archives, navigate to Tools, Archives. This shows a list of all currently configured archives. From the list view, the following details about each archive are shown. The name, the integrated bucket, the number of files, the size. If the visibility is set to private, the tenants that can access it will be shown here. The visibility. And if the archive uses a public URL. To add a new archive, click Add. Once an archive is created, we can access the detail page by clicking on the left here. The archive details page contains information about the archive configuration as well as a list of files currently stored in the archive. From here, it is worth noting the Actions dropdown, which allows you to download the zip file of the archive or edit it. To add new files to the archive from the Details page, click the Add button here. When adding a new file, users may browse the file system on the local computer to select a file. From the Files list, download or delete individual files by clicking on the appropriate selection from the Actions menu. To view the Details page of each file, click on the name. The Links tab contains any download links which have been generated, both active and expired. The History tab contains historical information about the file, including creation and deletion of download links and download events. The Scripts tab contains a guide for getting started using archive stored files and scripts. Hopefully, this overview was helpful. For more information, visit our documentation link below. Thank you.